go. Folks, this one is gonna be brutal. Here's Charlotte making her way to the ring. She's all business tonight. You can see that she's come with absolutely no trimmings. She's here to do a job to take out that fiend Abaddon. And after being thrown into this match by Stephanie McMahon, Charlotte is looking to make the most of it. We know that her and Abaddon have had some serious problems dating back to Abaddon's arrival here in the LCW universe, in which she cost Charlotte Flair a shot at the WWE title. And Charlotte sure as heck has not forgotten that. And here she comes. This freak. This monster. She has been on a path of destruction since arriving here. Not only has she cost Charlotte a shot at the WWE title, she has seemingly abducted Shayna Baszler. No one has seen Shayna since Abaddon's match with her, after which they both disappeared from the ring under the cover of darkness. And since then, Nia Jax has been looking to get answers from Abaddon as one of Shayna's closer friends. And Abaddon has not given even one hint. But Nia, in the process, has taken some almighty beatings. And thankfully, Bailey has been there to back her up. Because Abaddon is inhuman. She is causing absolute devastation here. And we saw her last week in Charlotte after this match was announced and thank goodness Charlotte got the better of her there attacking her with a chair backstage escaping unscathed and you gotta think that the Queen Charlotte Flair is looking to really do a number on Abaddon here but Charlotte you don't want this to go long, because Abaddon has shown absolutely no mercy, and hardcore rules mean anything goes. You can fight in the ring, out of the ring, use anything you find, no count outs, no disqualifications. You can only win by pinfall, submission, or knocking your opponent clean out. And Abaddon is a fearsome opponent here. I'm scared for Charlotte. But I also know how great she is. And wouldn't it be fantastic to see her with a belt around her waist? Even if it was that disgusting hardcore strap. Here we go. I'm not looking forward to this one. But we gotta get it on. And let's do this thing. Uh -huh. Abaddon coming straight in with big punches. We've seen over her time in the LCW universe that she has ungodly resiliency. She has taken some huge shots. Not least from Charlotte with a chair last week. And oh my god, she just keeps coming back. And that's a scary prospect when you're in a match and anything could happen. Charlotte, you're gonna have to throw the kitchen sink and more at Abaddon. But you can bet your bottom dollar that Charlotte knows. And she's coming to cause absolute devastation here to the woman that's responsible for setting her off on the losing streak she's suffered so far in this universe. If it weren't for Abaddon interfering in that match between Charlotte and Ember Moon on the first ever roar in the LCW universe, this could be an entirely different story. Charlotte could be facing Becky Lynch 
for the WWE title tonight. She could be where she belongs in the main event. But no, instead, Asuka faces Becky Lynch tonight. And Charlotte is stuck in a horrendous match with this monster. That was a good move from the top rope though by Charlotte. And she ain't showing any intimidation. And you gotta love that about her. Because a lot of women would step through the ropes against Abaddon and lose it before their first bell even rung. Look at this, putting a stretch on Abaddon's neck. That's it, Queen. Keep it up. You're the best in the business. And even if you gotta fight with hardcore rules, you're still the best. And you're gonna come out on top on this and show Abaddon exactly who the boss is and why. And now what a look at this stretching out Charlotte Flair. What kind of move is that? And immediately she's coming out of the ring looking for some kind of weapon like the cheating scum she is. Oh my god! A sledgehammer to the gut and that said Charlotte come back at her. A sledgehammer to the gut there. Abaddon, you beast, you monster. And she's going for another backbreaker here on Charlotte. Off the hinder with a goddamn sledgehammer. And Charlotte may not know where she is right now. The queen don't go down that easy though. Here we go, kicking Abaddon's leg there. Trying to slow her down. But here we see Abaddon, absolutely the most resilient superstar in the WWE. And she's got Charlotte Flair up, and it's gonna be a heavy landing. There we go. Oh, Charlotte, you're in big trouble here. And that monster's going back for a sledgehammer. Oh my god, right into Charlotte's body. That's a sledgehammer, everybody. A sledgehammer to a human being. Oh my god, how is Charlotte standing? And that's it. Oh, Abaddon dropped across the top turnbuckle. That's the least you deserve, you monster. Keep it up, Charlotte. This is more like it. And stretching out Abaddon's arm. Charlotte's gonna take her apart limb by limb here and it's time for a neck breaker from the middle rope fantastic move charlotte and now it's her turn to pick up the sledgehammer and abaddon you deserve everything you get her shots there but look at this how the hell do you slow abaddon down she's back up and it's as though nothing happened to her this is after being hit with a goddamn sledgehammer. What are you in there with, Charlotte? And Abaddon's going back for more. What's she looking for here? A kendo stick out of the face of Charlotte. And then beating her across the abdomen. Run, Charlotte. That's right. Oh, a shot to the head. And Charlotte's got the stick. And yes, Charlotte. Put it to Abaddon. Don't stop until she's out. And you're the hardcore champion. Oh, but Abaddon has taken back the kendo stick. Oh my god! And here comes Bailey. Bailey's had her problems with Abaddon. She's backed up Nia when Abaddon has been beaten on her. We saw Abaddon injure Bailey a couple of weeks back. And she's coming with a steel chair for Abaddon. And Charlotte, this could be your moment. Oh, Bailey. You leveled the score here, and she's getting out of here before things turn even uglier. Charlotte, put Abaddon away. She has just taken a hell of a beaten great clothesline there, Charlotte. Oh, Abaddon, you reap what you sow. You injured Bailey. It's great to see her back, and it's great to see her getting a little payback on you. And look at Charlotte, playing to the crowd. They may not be impressed with her, but oh my god, I am. Anyone who steps in a ring with Abaddon and can do this to her, 
Oh my god. Charlotte lifting Abaddon up. She spins around and then that's it, a modified stunner jawbreaker there. Abaddon finally looks to be in trouble and Charlotte says just bring it. And what's she waiting for here? They're square enough. And they both go for a shot at the same time. But Abaddon gets there first. And she's got Charlotte now. Up. Oh, tosses her down onto the hard concrete floor. And Abaddon is recovering here from those brutal chair shots. Driving Charlotte into the floor again. And an elbow to the solar plexus. Charlotte, it was going so well. And a jawbreaker there, and then a clothesline. Maybe this ain't over for Charlotte. Maybe she's still got enough in the tank. This is good. Abaddon's up again. And face first into the ramp there. That was a big move. Great work, Charlotte. But Abaddon slips under the grapple. And lifts Charlotte back up. And oh my god, whips her down to the floor. And what are you doing, Abaddon? Oh, look at that. A stomp right to the chest. Oh, Abaddon. She knows no limits. If anyone's gonna win a hardcore match, it's gonna be this woman. Everything she does is hardcore. She doesn't obey any rules here in the WWE. And I gotta tell you, it might be a stroke of genius from Stephanie McMahon booking her into this hardcore match. Because you can bet your bottom dollar if this were a plain one-on-one, -on -one, Abaddon would have no trouble using a sledgehammer or anything else on the Queen. And so you might as well make it legal and give Charlotte a chance to get a little bit going in her direction too. And Charlotte, there's a steel chair right there. You wanna use it. You wanna use anything you can. Please, put Abaddon away. We don't need this kind of superstar holding a belt in the LCW. And Abaddon takes away Charlotte's legs and an elbow to the chest. And then look at this strength. Lifting Charlotte up above her head. And looks to ya drops her down onto the concrete floor. And then falling down across her leg. Charlotte is taking so much damage here. I don't want to think what this match will do to either of these women. And it's a suplex. Was that on the chair? It might well have been. Oh God, Charlotte. When are you going to be able to get back to normal after this match? You look completely out of it. Come on, Charlotte. Back into the ring. Make this a wrestling match as much as you can. And look at Abaddon. She don't want to wrestle. Tossing Charlotte across the ring. And then look at that punch. She's a wrecking machine. Oh my god. Sledgehammer to the leg of Charlotte to the knee. Oh my god. How is Charlotte going to be able to keep going here? Her knee being hyper extended across the rope. And Abaddon is looking to take all the mobility from Charlotte. And imagine a woman who can't move. She'll be a sitting duck. Abaddon, this is insane. Oh my god, a splash. Is it gonna be over? No, Abaddon isn't going for a pin here. It's like she doesn't care about winning. She just wants to inflict as much pain as she can on Charlotte Flair here. And Charlotte whips her outside of the ring. I'm not sure this is the best tactic, Charlotte. But what are you going for? What are you gonna hit Abaddon with? And it's a baseball bat. Oh, but Abaddon's there too quickly. A damn baseball bat. Nothing is off limits here. And Charlotte, you may need a baseball bat. Oh my god, another sledgehammer to the body of Charlotte Flair. But she comes back with a big boot. Oh. Boy, the shots that Charlotte has taken tonight. I just can't believe it. And she's going for a pinfall. I think this is the first attempt of the evening, but it's a two. Oh, you were close, Charlotte. 
Don't worry about winning the title. Just worry about getting this match done. And then pulling Abaddon over to center ring. What's she going for here? Oh, Abaddon going for a small package. Looks like she's had enough of the queen. But the queen kicks out. And what's wrong, Abaddon? You worried that you're gonna lose this one? You worried that your reputation's gonna be ruined? You better be worried, cause Charlotte is as good as they come, and you're in a lot of trouble, Abaddon. And is Charlotte? No, Abaddon kicks out. I thought she was going for the figure eight there. And roll over into a pin there, good sunset flip. That's two, and it's a kick out. Abaddon isn't ready to go yet, and you know she needs a lot of beating down. But maybe Charlotte is looking to put her to sleep here. Abaddon's head squeezed in between the queen's thighs, and cutting off all blood to her head. But no, Abaddon escapes, and that could be Charlotte's best chance here. Putting Abaddon out completely. And the moonsault from the top rope. Fantastic move from Charlotte. She's starting to get on top of Abaddon here. And Abaddon is definitely slowing down. I think the queen is getting to her. And maybe Charlotte's gonna finish her off. Big move there. And she's going for the sledgehammer. And to the leg. Softening Abaddon up for the figure eight. Charlotte though going for a pin here. No, Abaddon kicks out. And Charlotte, a sledgehammer to the leg is always a good move when you got the figure eight in your locker. Keep it up. Take Abaddon out. What's she after here? It's another kendo stick. We've already seen a kendo stick explode over the head of Charlotte. And look at that shot to the kidney. Sending Charlotte down. And now Abaddon with a power bomb. And that might be it. But she doesn't go for the pinfall. She picks Charlotte up. She ain't done with her yet. And the queen lifting Abaddon up and driving her down to the mat. And it could be time for the figure eight. Look at this, the figure four is on. Oh, you're in trouble now, Abaddon. Charlotte might snap your leg clean in two. She's bridged it to the figure eight. Wait a minute, what the hell is happening? The lights have gone out. Has Abaddon quit? Is Charlotte the champion here? What is happening? I can't see a damn thing, and neither can anyone in this arena. Oh my god, it's Shayna. It's Shayna Baszler. She's back. We haven't seen her for three weeks since Abaddon seemingly abducted her. And she don't look in a great state. But you gotta think she's coming to get revenge on her captor. Abaddon, you're in trouble now. You reap what you sow. And you're about to reap a whole lot of violence. And what's Abaddon encouraging Shayna to do? Oh my god! Shayna, what are you doing? Why have you hit the queen when you got Abaddon right in front of you? The queen has never done anything to you. And Shayna is going after Charlotte Flair with that bat. Oh my god, another shot to the head. And now she's pounding her. Charlotte is helpless on the floor. Oh, this is horrendous. And it looks like Abaddon has got Shayna under some kind of spell. Oh, she's looking on. As Sheena absolutely destroys Charlotte Flair. I don't believe this. Sheena, what are you doing? Charlotte, struggling to her feet, but it's another headshot. And another with the baseball bat. Oh my god. Charlotte. Oh, she is out of this completely. And here comes Nia Jax. Nia, who's been trying to find Sheena all these weeks. And here she is. And Nia looks like she's trying to reason with Shayna. Telling her to drop the bat. Is she convincing Shayna though? Shayna looks like she's thinking about it. Oh boy, you don't want to cross Abaddon. 
She's imploring Shayna with her words, and there you go. A shot to the head of Nia, and I think we know now where Shayna stands. She's going for Nia, and Nia fighting back. After all these weeks, everything Nia has been through to try and find Shayna, to help her, and Shayna treats her like this. Shayna, you're as big a monster as Abaddon. Oh my god, look at Nia. She don't deserve this. But Nia fighting back. She's a tough woman here, and she ain't gonna be thrown around by no one. Shayna, you're picking on a bad woman here. Nia is gonna give you as much as she gets given. Oh, but back with Abaddon. She's putting a sledgehammer to Charlotte. Charlotte, who is barely conscious anyway. Who is trying to struggle to get into this. To get back into this. To do anything at all, quite frankly. Oh my god. This is just... Oh, Charlotte. She's gonna be half dead by the time the bell rings in this match. Oh my god. These two. Oh, this is brutal. And those stairs back on top of Charlotte. And what's Abaddon going for now? Oh, knee to the face of Charlotte. The queen. She will never be the same after this. And no title is worth this. Abaddon, pin Charlotte. Get it over. This is not wrestling anymore. This is actual bodily harm that's going on. This is assault. This is anything but wrestling. And look at that. Shoulder block takes the queen down. And Abaddon looks like she wants to end this in the ring on her terms. And it's a tombstone right onto the top of Charlotte's head. Oh my god. And finally, it's over. Abaddon wins. But I have never seen a match where a woman has taken a beat down like that. Charlotte Flair, oh my god. And even the ref is terrified of Abaddon, and rightly so. But what about Shayna Baszler? What the hell is that all about? Oh, Abaddon, what are you doing in this universe? She's a hardcore champion, but I don't like it. I don't like it one bit.